Good morning. I'm Jan p a t h a t p u t o n Jan p a t h a t p u t o n is my name actually, and this is my show. Can you see this? English in the garden. The name of my show: English in the garden. Uh, this morning, as you can see behind me, I'm in my library. Uh, the garden is just over there. Uh, maybe next time I can show you my beautiful garden. Anyway, I'm John p a t h a t p u t o n I'm an English language teacher. I have been teaching English for over 20 years um, at a university level, and I feel that I'm sure I can share with you some of my uh, experience. And some of my um, ideas, maybe you know, they are useful for you. And usually, I will actually talk to you. Uh, you may be um, a person uh, who is learning English uh, at a school or at a university level, or you can be anybody, anyone who is. Uh, Learning to speak and to read the English language at all. So this is the show for you. If you like my show, this is a bit of advertisement. Uh, if you like my show, you can you're welcome to subscribe to my channel, Janpa Channel, and you will have access to wow over one thousand videos I have created. Through this YouTube channel, and I would like to say thank you to YouTube. Uh, I would not uh, have the opportunity if it were not for the accessibility or the generosity of uh, uh, Google and YouTube. So I would like to thank you, my uh, sponsors. So this morning, um, this is the fourth of February, twenty twenty. Three, now the fourth of February, twenty twenty three. And the question I would like to, I mean, the topic for today that I would like to uh, talk a little bit more is about the question of who, not the World Health Organization, but the question of who when it comes to uh, learning. And practicing the English language, the first law or the first principle in learning anything is practicing. So, the more you practice, the better for your learning. So, but who should you talk to? When you talk to people, uh, one way to learn is to talk to people. So, who should we? Talk to. Um, well, normally you can uh, uh, talk to uh, native speakers uh, if you happen to be around. Like um, if you uh, say you walk into uh, one of the tourist destinations or attractions, like uh, the near the Grand Palace, and you happen to be around a lot of. Uh, international tourists, maybe you can you know strike a conversation. I I I I am sure most international visitors to Thailand would love to uh, have a chat with uh, the locals. So you can actually be a very welcoming, uh, what we call welcoming host, right? So you can actually uh, enjoy uh, talking. Uh, with uh, you know international visitors, another idea is to actually talk to um, people that you can have access to or the internet. But you have to be very careful when you have a chat either through the text or through the video chat with other people because. Uh, Sometimes it is not safe, so you have to be very careful. And the third way of 
talking to people is actually talking to a machine. You know, you can actually uh, talk to a chatbot. You know, there are many uh, chatbots that can actually uh, converse with you in the English language. One example is English X. You can chat with a chatbot. You know, that's, I mean, it's not the best uh, compared with chatting with human beings, but it is better than chatting with no one. Okay. So you can actually talk to fallen visitors. You can talk to uh, your online friends. They have to be careful. You can talk to, uh, you know, machines like chatbots uh, that can actually uh, uh, help you to uh, practice the language. There are other people that you can talk to. Actually, when we talk about who, you need to understand that when you read a book, you know, or any book at all, when you read a book, you can actually talk to uh, the author, but you can talk to the author uh, indirectly. You know, you can uh, maybe interact with the book by asking questions. And yeah, that, that's, that's, a, that's a way. Reading is actually talking to people. I am Janpa Thadphuton. I'm here to chat with you about English language learning. And if you like my show, don't forget to uh, subscribe to my channel, Janpa channel, English in the Garden. Talk to you later. See you in my next video.